Hey everybody, JCB here at The Awesomest, and you're watching an Awesomest Quickie. So odds are, if you're a Windows 10 user, you've come across this stupid yellow exclamation point this past week. Apparently Microsoft broke something recently because there have been a lot of people suffering from this problem. It's an annoying pain in everyone's butt, and has even been affecting some Windows 7 and 8 users as well. Basically, this yellow exclamation point means you cannot connect to the internet. It doesn't matter if you have Wi-Fi or hardwire, it doesn't matter what brand of computer you have, this little guy is going to ruin your day. Well, here's how to fix it. Hold your Windows key and press R to open a run box. Now type CMD and press enter. You will be presented with a little black box that looks like something out of a hacker movie. This is a command prompt. It's what all computers looked like once upon a time, and this latest bug from Microsoft has given it a new life. Go ahead and type ipconfig into this box, then press the spacebar and type slash release. Make sure you have your slash right, and then press enter. This will release the current IP address your computer is trying to use to connect to the internet. Next, in that same black box, type ipconfig space slash renew, then press enter. This will tell the computer to get a new IP address to connect to the internet with. Now just wait for about 60 seconds. In most cases, after about a minute or so, the little exclamation point will vanish and you can go about the rest of your day. But in other cases, an additional step is needed. Close the little black box, next press and hold the Windows key, and then press X. This will pop up a little menu where you can select Command Prompt with Admin in parentheses. This will open the same command prompt in administrator mode. You will probably get a warning from Windows asking if you want to do this. Go ahead and click yes. Next in that black box, type netsh space winsock space reset. Now press enter. In most cases, your PC will have to reboot before the change takes effect. So save any work you were in the middle of and shut down your PC. When you restart, this little jerk should be gone. If this video helped you, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe as that does help me out quite a bit. And also be sure to check out some of my other videos as I do release new content every week. And until next time, keep being awesome. It's Sunday, November 27th, and we are checking out Six Flags Magic Mountain's Holiday in the Park. Holiday in the Park is Six Flags retheming of Magic Mountain. Unfortunately for a large portion of the park, Holiday in the Park simply means there are Christmas wreaths and lights everywhere. Hey look, a dreidel.